Hey guys, each step is important. Don't skip any steps. I am going to show you how to fix auto restart problem Windows 11. Press Windows and X key together to open options. Then click on search. Now type TSKMGR in the search bar and open task manager from the list. You can right click on it and run it as an administrator. Now pay attention for some user task manager can open in a quick mode. So if this is the case, then you need to click see details link to open it in a regular mode. Now click on file menu and select run new task. Then we need to select a file. So click on a browse button. Just follow my screen. Open C drive. Move to this folder. Then try to find a file with name CMD here, right. Select it and click open. Now pay attention at this point. Now we have to run this task as an administrator writes. So make sure you check this box. And then click OK. Now a command prompt will open up. Type this command. Which is GP update. This will take a few seconds to complete. You can pause the screen till then. Now since it is executed, just type CLS. And the next command would be chkdsk with the parameter of our OS installation drive. In my case it is C drive, just cross verify the results with my screen. Make sure it is executed well. Now, type exit and close all the windows before we proceed to next step. In this step, click on search icon. Then search for regedit. Click here to open registry editor. Now expand HK local machine. Then you need to expand software folder. Now expand Microsoft folder. Just scroll down. And search for Windows folder in Microsoft folder. Simply right click on it, select new, and click on key, and rename it as Windows Update. Again right click on Windows Update, select new, then click on key, and rename it as a U again right click on it, select new, and as per your system configuration, select bit value. So, my system type is 64 bit. Then, I will go for Keyword 64-bit value and rename it as No Auto Reboot with Logged On User. Again right click on it, select Modify. Simply set value data as to 1 and close all windows. That's it guys your problem is solved and you are good to go.